Cheat codes, shortcuts, fast tracks, do they really exist for skincare? Well, we're gonna find out in today's video. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna have some fun with skincare. Not that we don't always have fun with skincare, but today we're gonna have some real fun with skincare because we're gonna talk about cheat codes. Now, if you don't know what a cheat code is, it gets its origin in the gaming community. In fact, in gaming, it is a way to get higher levels, special powers, shortcuts, just ways to do better, win faster, and go higher. So what does that have to do with skincare? Well, it doesn't matter if you're 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, or older, everybody, and I mean everybody, wants to have the best looking skin in the fastest way possible. Just look at the amount of plastic surgery that we see in America today. So we're gonna talk some cheat codes for skincare because they actually do work. And I would know because I just turned 59 in March and I think I look pretty good, but all of these cheat codes I'm about to give you are the things I've been doing since my early 20s. Cheat code number one is to protect your skin from the sun. Okay, I don't care how much controversy there is out there in the world about should you wear sunscreen, should you not wear sunscreen, do you stop getting vitamin D when you wear sunscreen, does it cause cancer, you need to wear sunscreen. I've looked at hundreds of studies that prove over and over again sunscreen protects your skin from the damaging effects of the sun. Again, I've been using it since I was like 17. SPF 30, every day, all day, reapply it every couple of hours, protect your skin for the damaging effects of the sun. As you get older, 70 to 90% of the visible signs of aging are due to photo aging, damage to your DNA and your skin from the sun. Nuff said, sunscreen, sunscreen, sunscreen. Have I told you? You need to wear sunscreen. Cheat code number two, cleanse your skin every single day. Make sure you get oil, dirt, bacteria, and all cosmetics, including the sunscreen I just harped at you about, off your skin, especially at night. And make sure you're picking the right cleanser for your skin. It should never feel tight, stretched out, squeaky clean. That's not what we want. That means the cleanser is too strong. If you have normal to dry skin, you wanna use a creamy style cleanser that's very hydrating and leaves your skin supple and moist. And if you have oily, acne-prone skin, you wanna use a cleanser that's clarifying, clear, foamy, and is able to get down on those pores and scoop out any excess oil, sebum, dirt, bacteria, and cosmetics. Clean, pH-balanced skin means all your other skincare products are going to work better. Cheat code number three is to make sure that you are exfoliating your skin at least two to three times a week. As we get older, starting in our 20s, unfortunately, our skin cell turnover slows down. That means a buildup of excess dry, dead skin cells on the surface of your skin, leading to larger looking pores, that sandy textured feeling, and contributing to the early onset of fine lines and wrinkles. So we want that dead skin off. Now there are a lot of ways to get that dead skin off. You can use mechanical devices, sponges, exfoliating towels, but you can also use serums that are AHA or BHA based, and that's alpha hydroxy acid like glycolic acid or lactic acid, or BHAs, which are salicylic acid, which help loosen that bond between the old dead skin cells and the new skin cells underneath, instantly revealing better, younger, healthier looking skin. Cheat code number four has to do with making sure that you're getting antioxidant properties onto the surface of your skin to help minimize oxidation, free radical damage, and premature skin cell death. Yes, premature skin cell death, all of which leads to the degradation of the surface of your skin and its barrier, which protects you from the environment, irritants like pollution, and actually helps contribute to water loss on the skin, something we call transepidermal water loss. So make sure you're using skincare products that contain these antioxidants so that you can protect your skin from all of these goings on that's going to help make you look older. Now, if you don't know what to choose, I will put a list of my recommended products down below the video description box and you can check those out when we're done here today. The next cheat code is a really big one and it is to incorporate retinoids these are derivatives of vitamin A into your skincare routine. You can do that through over-the-counter retinol products, or you can go all the way to prescription strength retinoin, which most people know as Retin-A. And the reason it's so important to incorporate these retinoids in the first place is because they help produce more collagen in the layers of the skin. They help protect the elastin that you do have. They help fade and minimize fine lines, wrinkles, dark spots and hyperpigmentation and keep them from reoccurring. And if that wasn't enough, they help speed up cellular turnover as well, giving you a much more youthful skin in the least 
amount of time possible. And cheat code number six, easy peasy. Make sure you're hydrating from the inside out. Sip water throughout the day. Make sure you get enough water in your body to keep your skin hydrated from the inside out and to flush out the toxins and keep the production of your new skin cells humming. Cheat code number seven, equally easy, get enough sleep. Every night, make sure you're trying to get six to nine hours of sleep. It varies between people. Six is really good enough for me. And in fact, if I get six, I've done well. But the reason it's so important is that the skin has an overnight repair cycle that occurs between about 10 o'clock at night and three o'clock in the morning. So if you're not sleeping, that cycle's not happening and it can build up over time. When it comes to skin, sleep is everything. And cheat code number eight is to clean up that diet, removing as much processed food, sugar, salt, and hydrogenated oils as possible and leaning more towards a healthy diet of leafy greens, vegetables, fruits, seeds, and nuts. And part of maintaining that healthy lifestyle is making sure you get enough exercise. I've quoted this study several times on the channel. They did a study October 2022 of sedentary individuals between 55 and 75 and gave them activities to do just some moderate exercise every single day without really even changing their diet much. And guess what happened? The participants who stuck with it were able to roll back three years of biological aging in just eight weeks. Imagine what a year of moderate activity will do. Moderate activity does not mean running a marathon. It means getting up, moving, play some tennis, swim in the pool, work in the backyard, chase your dog, whatever. Just make sure you're moving some every single day. And of course it goes without saying to avoid smoking and limit your alcohol consumption because those are two things right there that can age your skin faster than your genetics ever could. Just remember when it comes to keeping your skin looking healthy and youthful, two things you need to know. Patience and consistency are the keys. It's gonna take some time for you to see results, but I can promise you with some consistency and patience, in a very short amount of time, within a month, two months, three months, you're gonna see a vast improvement in the way your skin looks and it's gonna look good for the rest of your life. And for even more ways to turn back the clock on skin aging, be sure to check out this video that's coming up next. Thank you guys for watching and supporting my channel. I appreciate it, stay beautiful, subscribe if you haven't, and I will see you over on that next video.